First thing that we're going to do is remove any junk and rust and debris off of the backer plate. Get a nice clean surface free of any debris. Scrub it real good with a wire brush. Use any cleaner if needed as well. Once this is all clean, we want to make sure that we start off now by putting in some of this anti-seize lubricant right here. I'm going to be using this Permatex. You want to apply that. There's three points. We have one down the bottom, the middle, and the top. Those are contact points. They're on both sides, so you have it on the left side, and you also have it over here on the right side. And that's where the actual brake shoes are going to be making contact. Once it's in place, as you can see here, those are your locations. And then we can start putting all the hardware together. And here we have all the hardware, all the springs, everything connected to the wheel cylinder. And then we're just ready to put everything back together with the hub bearing assembly.